Hello everyone, welcome to my channel ESP.NET.Core and today I am going to fix that type of error. Application DB context does not contain a definition for database and no accessible extension method database accepting a first argument of type application DB context could be found. Are you missing a using directive or assembly reference? When we click on the show potential, then there is a no hint. I mean to say that uh, it's a namespace error actually. If you have uh, Microsoft.EntityFrameworkCore package installed in your project then that type of problem will not occur actually so just of a, first of all just download or you can say just add a nuget package uh, in your project so the package is just uh, search in a browse in a nuget package browse tab that is identity and select microsoft.aspnetcore.identity.entityframeworkcore so you can say that uh, it's a added project file that is 6.0 uh, you are working uh, with the 6.0 framework then just add six latest package of the uh, latest release or you can say the stable version of the package that is 6.0.12 and uh, if you are working with the 7.0 then you can must install the 7.0 package of the um, microsoft asp.net core.identity.entity framework core so entity framework core is a need to require that uh, types of fixing so microsoft so just you can uh, you can see that your package is installed successfully just after a uh, few seconds your problem will automatically resolve uh, so you can see that the context.database.insure created is uh, running very well so thank you guys for watching this video and keep watching all other videos which is related to asp.net core